Rachel and I'm in King's Cross in central London. Most people when they think of Michelin starred food they think of white tablecloths, haute cuisine, high prices but this doesn't have to be the case. I'm here because Hawker Chan has come over from Singapore for three days only. He is a Michelin star chef and he's the first chef to get a Michelin star for street food. We're here to try Hawker Chan's char siu pork, which is sticky pork served with rice. It's going to cost just £6, so we're going to see why it's so amazing and why it got a Michelin star. Chef Chan started as a hawker in Singapore. Hawker centres are open-air collections of inexpensive street food stands beloved in Singapore, Malaysia, Indonesia and beyond. Because我们是用五花肉来做,所以我也今年来代表新加坡来希望这里的人也喜欢吃这种有一点椒,而且用五花肉被拌回收的肉给这里的当地人吃,希望他们很喜欢。super long queue here for people wanting to try this really famous dish. I've got my token and I'm excited to try it. Well I was here from about like 10 o'clock so I queued out and a half but the queue's ridiculous so it must be popular right? We waited for about an hour. An hour, an hour and a half. Hawker Chan was here last year and he made his soy sauce chicken so we were like, we've got to try it again because that was incredible. And, um, yeah, we loved it. <laughs> so we came back. It's really, really good. good. It's really good. Really good. I like, I, I don't usually eat a lot of pork, I would say, but like, this is really good. So I'm a chief from exchange in uh, from Singapore and so I actually really miss Asian food. And so I came here today to try some of my like, hometown favorites, which is the chassis rice. And it's really wonderful. Yeah, it's really awesome. So I've had this in Singapore as well, but it's just nice having home food food like all the way in London. Wow, I was here since about 10.30 and the queue was insane. So I'm actually pretty lucky that I came a little bit earlier and it's a, I think it's a typical Singaporean thing to come to earlier too. <laughs> queue for good food. It's definitely yeah. worth the, the wait. It tastes different than the like conventional <laughs> typical <laughs> Before eating the famous dish, I wanted to ask Hawker Chan where it originated. 其实我在小的时候就在农场里面生长所以我对有些食物比较喜欢去煮因为觉得它是一种每天生活里面多姿多彩的享受来的所以我就确定在这行里面发展 Hi, thank you I've got my Michelin star street food right here. I've got a good amount of rice, which came with some sauce on, cucumber, the all-important sticky sauce, meat's tender. Like, you do not need a knife. Mmm. Oh my god. How is that so good? Oh, wow. Oh wow. Oh my god, that's amazing. The pork has this like incredible caramelized crispiness. And but then it's so juicy with and it's not fatty. Like sometimes a fatty texture is horrible, but it's not fatty at all. The meat is just cooked to perfection. I think it's this sauce underneath which totally makes it. It's like sweet and umami and so flavoursome. The rice is like sticky as well already without the sauce. After getting the hot sauce, I want 
啊、呃，很多 h o c k e r 里面的小贩都会像我这样继续努力啊啊、呃呃，必定会有一天他们会得到的。所以我自己的啊、呃，希望就是说，能够每一天继续做好的食物，就是啊、呃，新的开始。嗯。This actually isn't the first time I'm eating Hawker Chan's food. I've been to his original store in Singapore where I had his sticky chicken with the same rice and the same sauce. Um, it's actually about half the price over there than it's being sold for here. But you know what? I think the pork's better and I very rarely choose pork over chicken. It's so good and just has that incredible juicy texture which you don't always get with chicken. I'm a fan. Have finished my pork and it was so so delicious totally worthy of a Michelin star and actually I think it's lovely that street food can get recognized for how good it is <laughs> <laughs>